obviously true in some cases, but it goes back to the basic distinction which I was trying to make, which is types of products and types of markets. So allocative efficiency in a snapshot of current excessive price, you're right. But if there is even a little extra incentive for others to enter into this market, if there is ability to enter into this market, I would argue that dynamic considerations outweigh the static ones probably by much. And I'm much more interested about the dynamic, call it competitive process. But in any case, the distinction should be, let's look at the market. Is this a stable, high entry barrier market which requires some regulation or not? And that is something which antitrust in this area doesn't do. Yeah, no, I, I agree. Um, I agree. I think 